Meghan epitomizes Chick through her outfits and accessories in Invictus Games. The Duchess of Sussex wore the chicest ensemble at the Invictus Games in Germany with Prince Harry. Though quiet luxury is the term coined for the minimalistic style agenda that is dominating this year. Meghan was the unofficial queen of this ultra-refined aesthetic long before 2023. And her latest look proves how a designer accessory can make any outfit look incredibly expensive. The Duchess of Sussex made an appearance alongside Prince Harry at the 2023 Invictus Games, an international sporting event founded by the Duke of Sussex in 2014 for wounded, injured and sick servicemen and women, both serving and veterans. I'm thrilled that the first event I've been to for Invictus is here with all of you. It's amazing, and the mood so far is off to a good start. Meghan said to the crowd, so I'm really proud to be part of this Invictus family with all of you. I'm grateful for all of you that are here. Naturally, she looked categorically chic for the occasion. Wearing a black airline mid-length shirt dress from American clothing retailer Banana Republic. Though she has a plethora of impeccable designer numbers in her wardrobe. The stylish duchess is a penchant for picking out affordable ensembles that slot perfectly onto her ultra-chic dress code. The former actress left three buttons undone at the body of her dress to create a more relaxed neckline. And paired it with black stiletto pumps from her go-to footwear label Aquazura and a leather belt from Bottega Veneta. Megan used the designer accessory to add interest to her outfit. It gave the dress a more fitted silhouette by breaking up the bodies. And the skirt whilst cinching in her waist, and eschewing any colour including a metal buckle kept the look uniformed. Whilst the intricate woven style of Otago's signature elevated her look. Her all black look proved that a simple luxury accessory can help an inexpensive outfit look impeccably chic. Another fashionista to demonstrate the power of luxury appendages recently is Sophia Ritchie. Who wore in her Miss Kelly enveloped back for a dinner in New York City. The shorter, cuboid shaped version of the cult adored Kelly stopped us in our tracks, and completely changed the dynamic of her look. If investing in quiet luxury clothing isn't on the cards, opt for an accessory instead it will still create a show-stepping effect, as proven by Meghan. Arriving with her husband Prince Harry Meghan lit up the arena with her radiant smile and glowing complexion. Power dressing has long been an attribute of Meghan's style file, particularly her penchant for tailored shorts. Donning a cool and casual ensemble, Meghan wore a smart black trimmed cardigan from J. Crew and high-waisted white shorts from Stord. The Duchess slipped into Chanel leather toe-capped ballet flats, elevating her off-duty get up to enjoy the games with her husband Prince Harry. Her glossy raven hair was styled in bouncy curls. While she highlighted her ageless beauty glow with a rosy blush, smoky eye makeup and natural lip gloss. Long line shorts have been declared Meghan's signature look ever since she debuted a pair during a lunch date in New York City in 2022. Chiming in on her go-to wardrobe staples, royal style fans previously wrote on Instagram. Meghan does casual looks so well. Belted shorts and oversized shirts, to me, are one of her signature looks. Her signature style. And fits her very well. She has beautiful, long legs. Colors and styling are prima. A big hit. Penned another fan, as a third quipped, super chick. As always. The 90s style trend was formerly loved by the late Princess Diana. The former Princess of Wales was a fan of wearing the crisp, tailored long line shorts in the warmer months. Often teaming her trend sitting bottoms with feminine blouses and a buckled belt. Meghan channeled office chick as she made her first official appearance at the 2023 Invictus Games on Tuesday. The Duchess of Sussex joined her husband Prince Harry three days after he arrived in Germany. And greeted the crowds by apologizing for being a little late to the party. Admitting she had to spend time at home getting our little ones settled. The 42-year-old royal made the case for high-low fashion. Wearing a sleek shirt dress by US high street brand Banana Republic for the occasion. She accessorized the all-black outfit with a matching woven leather belt by Bottega Veneta and the Quasura suede heeled pumps. This timeless black shirt dress from M and S is made from smooth satin plissé for a luxurious feel. Like Megan's it is a self-tied belt at the waist and gentle pleating through the skirt. It features gathering at the shoulders and falls to a mid axi length. With its shirt style collar and buckle waist belt, 
This black midi dress from Mango is similar to Megan's but slightly less reminiscent of office attire. Cut in a flowy fabric with an Eversay design, we dress it up with black stilettos. The mother of two, looked smart and sophisticated in a structured black blazer from Kayla and Blazer. Layering her designer outerwear over her matching J. Crew top, and black denim jeans from Frame. The Duchess leveled up her low-key glamour with a pair of beige trainers. Beaming in new photographs beside her husband. Megan's glowy complexion was highlighted with a dewy foundation, a flush of peachy blush and a dramatic smoky eye makeup. And the royal's raven hair was styled in a sleek side part, elevated with soft curls and draped over her shoulders. Thank you for watching. If you like our video, would you please help us like, share and subscribe our channel. Wish you happy to see our videos, thank you very much.